I hope you enjoyed your meal. I'll take this whenever you're ready. Your ring is just so beautiful. I've been admiring it this whole time. Thank you. Your husband has great taste. Oh, it's my wife, actually. Such a lucky lady to have her in my life. Wife? It's a scenario ripped right from the headlines. At a restaurant in Illinois, a couple refuses to tip their waitress simply because she's a lesbian. They leave her a note saying, can't tip someone who doesn't love Jesus. Bad tattoo. And that tattoo, an equality sign in rainbow stripes on the waitress's arm. Well, she's not getting any extra money out of us. If you overheard this couple... Marriage is heterosexual by definition. ...skip out on tipping their waitress simply because she's gay... It even says so in the Bible. What would you do? Today, our hidden cameras are rolling at the Daily Planet in LaGrangeville, New York. And instead of a tattoo, our actress Leah will be wearing this pin promoting LGBT pride, which hits close to home. You may now seal your vows with a kiss. She's happily married to her wife, Stacy. All right, guys. Hi, I have this for you. I'll leave Thank it. Thank you so You're much. Ready. You're oh, welcome. Your ring is so pretty. Beautiful. Thank you. What's your husband do? Oh, my wife's an accountant. You're married to a woman? Yeah, you have a picture if you want to see it's my No, I actually don't want it. You're a lesbian? Yeah. Right away, our couple's words draw in disapproving looks. Is that what that pin did? Is that a, a gay rights thing? All three women are listening. This one in particular. She's jumping in. Watch out. Excuse me, you don't need to be having this conversation with her right now. What she chooses to do with her life is her life. And you're being very rude. But you're hearing what she's saying. She's a and lesbian. And I am fully accepting that. You know that's a sin. We're very religious. That's great, but you're not demonstrating kindness. So please stop. Are we supposed to support this? Are we supposed to give her she's a tip? She's not asking for your support, she sir. She's asking me for a tip? Well, she was not to tip that. That's your choice. I can't believe they hire people like that here. I can't believe they hire people like this here. I can't believe they serve people like you here. She then suggests to our waitress to just walk away. You, okay? you know what, go ahead and just leave. You don't need to stand here and do this at all. Thank you. And this woman? You don't agree with this, do you? I do. Yeah. With the way we feel, right? No, I don't agree with you. I agree with her. She quickly shuts down our couple. It's her life. And I don't need to have this conversation. OK, let's go. I don't understand the world we're living in. Don't leave a penny no. more. After our couple storms off, we send our waitress back in. I'm really sorry about that. Thank you. Thank you. And these two customers rally together to show their support. You don't deserve that. Don't Thank let you. anyone stand there and talk to you like that. That's I can't that. really believe that. I keep looking for the cameras because this is like that show. <laughs> that show? All right, let's go ahead and break this one, all right? Well, in this case, it certainly is. Time to say hello. Hi there, how are you? Oh my God. Oh, wow. <laughs> what would you do? <laughs> this show all the time. I'm literally shaking. You were very upset. I was very upset. Nobody deserves to be treated that way, regardless of how they choose to be. Your message to people who believe what they believe? Don't judge. We need to be more open and accepting of people. Others serve criticism with a strong dose of sarcasm. Pay for the food, but we're not giving her a tip. Good for you. Jesus said all sinners should be punished. You should walk around telling people how to live their lives. But some people see eye to eye with our couple. But it's wrong. Government says it's okay. Tell it this way. They can't have any care. Yeah. And it's dangerous to take care of it all by itself until eventually went through some time. She's so pretty, I didn't even think that she was a lesbian. She's like waste. And that's a sin. I don't believe in you, but it's not my place to put her down. It is a sin, but I just, I'm trying to get with the world today. We roll again, and this time our husband writes a message on the bill, just like those diners did in Illinois. I'm writing, we don't tip sinners. That'll be her tip. 
Our angry and frustrated wife then turns to these customers for reassurance. I mean, would you tip her? Was she your actual wife? No, we're not going to give her money for her and her wife. Yeah, but her life doesn't impact your life, does it? But once again, no tip from our disgusted duo. You guys can tip her. Our waitress comes back in to grab the check. What? Did they write that? Yeah, did they, did wow. they tell you they were? Wow. All we've been saying since it started was wow. Really? It's I very didn't... upset. And it's a feeling that's dying out quicker. We don't feel that way. We roll one last time. Is this okay to take? No, no, I haven't done it yet. But understand, don't be looking for a tip in here. There won't Excuse be. Me. Immediately, this woman jumps right out of her seat. You are being very rude. Well, why should I? You are being very rude. And you know what? Only God can judge her. Please, let me. God has judged her. It's in the Bible. Be nice. That's all. Uh, she's pushing her agenda okay. right, with that right. pin on her. All right, stop, stop. Just be nice. Just be nice. Love is not wrong. Why, why, why are you defending her? Why are you defending this lesbian? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. If you are Isn't so funny? disgusted, leave. I will pay for your meal and you can leave. We're paying for our meal, but we're not leaving a dime a tip. I'm not supporting that lifestyle. Don't tip you. Don't worry about it. Don't tip you. As things get more heated. This is such a shame. Okay. I'm disgusted. You can get the hell out of here. You're disgusted. I'll drop you like a hot potato. Don't take that abuse from anybody. These women try to cool things down. Oh, it's okay. Thank you. It's okay. Thank you for saying. And if anything. anyone needs to say anything, if they say anything, they can come talk to us. Okay. Stranger standing up for this victim of bullying. That seems to be the special of the day here. Hi, sir. How are you doing? It's what would you do? I'm John Kinyonis. You were not about to stand for it. No. Bottom line, no. No, I, I was ready to let them have it. Like, you got to respect people's uh, feelings and their, their 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 lifestyle. It's just the way it should be. What did you think? I was very upset. It was just she reacts more externally, and I'm more in here shaking. And in the end, my first thing was to go hug her. It's love is love, and I just can't. I, just, I couldn't stand for it. And you know what? It's programs like yours that teach people to stand up and do these types of things. What do you think of the reactions? I mean, just to have people, I mean, she literally stood up. It's nice to see that other people, even if they don't feel the same way, you know, like that they support you. And it's real for a lot of people in all different ways, not just, you know, gay people, but people get discriminated against all the time, so it's, it's real.